Hey, you guys. Okay, so we have to hurry and get over to the live right now. Um, MFW and CJ and whoever else was on her panel when I had checked in earlier, CJ was screaming at this girl. I don't know who she is. I'm. He was kept screaming. She was following him from every community. Um, I'm, I was shocked at how loud and how chaotic it got. So she's still live right now, and she's very well known for um, <laughs> deleting them right away. So hi, Inferno. How are you? Hi, Auroras. So anyways, I have it paused at one of the parts where CJ came on, and um, I wanted to watch it together. So let me go ahead to the video. It was wild. It was chaotic. It was, I don't even know. Okay, wait. So I guess it ended. Hold on, I'm going to go to the part where, give me one second, you guys. Hi, Rudy. Hey, Rally Point. And all these. Hold on, you guys. I'm trying to get and there. And so, and now it's not. Hold on, you guys. Later, J Love. J Love. I'm not like a couple months ago. I never okay, noticed I'm that. I'm going to share it right now. <laughs> hey, sticky what fingers. What the fuck is that? Well, he shot up dupe in his hand. Uh, in his arm and killed the nerve. Trigger warning right now, like, you guys. No. Yeah, crickled his hand. Hey, Dax. Or he just masturbated too hard. Oh, jeez. All right, let's. Oh, shit. Two. I thought you were being serious. Like, he no, shot. I, I okay, hold on. Trigger warning. Hold on, let me pause it. Can't even Trigger warning now, you guys. It's going to get loud. It's going to get. It's going to get what it's going to get. So if you are at work or you have little ears around you. Okay, so this is where it starts. CJ was on the Real Drama Stars channel saying, Katie, this chick is a clout chaser. You are wasting your breath. I'm going to try and just let it play without talking a lot. I'm going to try. CJ, come on up. The live chat isn't up yet. Hey, hi, Tragic, come, come on up. Oh, wait. We got somebody. Here we go. I think it might be CJ right now. Yeah, okay. Buckle hey, in, you guys. Can you hear me? Yeah, yeah, it gets bad. Me? I hear you. Hey, you're being played by this chick. Like, I'm... Oh, I'm, like, I'm, like, I'm, I'm really, really... Listen, I'm not really fucking with you right now, Katie, but this chick is a cloud chaser, just wasting your time. Don't bother with this chick. She's wasting your fucking time. Oh. And I don't understand. Like, Brit, listen, she's an ex mod from like like a while back who was booted because she's upset. Bro, you need to chill and stop talking about me. You want me to bring Tush up here? You're I don't give a fuck what you do. I don't care what you do. Do you want me to bring her up here? Okay. For what? I don't know. Just to make you sweat. Why are you even up here? Why are you even up here? Like, why are you because there was why are you even talking that. about me? Why do you fucking care? It's just weird. You just enter every community I'm in. It's just fucking weird. You do this every, all, like all the time. All these Anytime I enter a community, you just follow are around. It's fucking are you bizarre. afraid of what you do? Are you afraid of your own actions being exposed to someone you were trying to play? And so you're what are you to talking play? about? I'm afraid of what? Oh, what you, I don't give a fuck what, what you do. You just look about. like a fucking weirdo, dude. You look it's like fucking a fucking weird. weird. Who takes money from everybody? Yeah, Why I don't know, you yeah. take me back? What do you mean? You borrowed money Why before I you? booted you. you. Why did you borrow money from me? What are you talking receipts? about? Why I put you out the receipts, receipts that you receipts? choose to ignore on purpose oh because God. you're in self Katie, you're wasting, you're wasting your time. You're fucking crazy. You're wasting your fucking time because you're never willing to <laughs> communicate like a regular fucking person and actually own your shit. Because I don't, because I don't communicate with crazy people. Motherfucker. Because I don't communicate with crazy people. Um, no, you've. So I want to warn you guys right now, he goes from this, like, from zero to 100. Like, it, he starts yelling a lot. I, yeah, I don't know who the other person is. Hey, AZ. Um, so MFW has somebody on her panel. CJ started typing things in the chat from what I saw, like, talking crap, like, why do you even have her on? She's a clout chaser. She's this, she's that. And then he finally comes up on panel. Like I said, I have no idea who this other person is. No idea. You've communicated with me just fine. It only changes when people tell the truth about you. 
So he leaves and then comes back. Rage quit. Come on, are you guys gonna what? I'm gonna go to where he comes back. Cause it's gonna be like any second. Your daughter, what? Jim! When you pick up, go get mad again. Has nothing to do with me. Who is she, Carlos? CJ. Fucking Zora. Tell me what what the fuck? Tell me your side. What the fuck? There is no about? side. There is no side. This chick just follows me into every community I go to and she tries like getting involved. Did did it, 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 the the yes, no, Aaron. She's just trying to message everybody. She's like, hey, I know everything about CJ. CJ's bad. I'll send you a bunch of videos. Like, why were you why were you messaging me on the 15th of December asking me if I stole What are you talking package? about? That wasn't even me. Out. What the fuck are you talking about? Number. Your phone number? You, you called me on, on your phone. phone. Were you hot? He's what are you talking hot. about? He's hot. You want me to put what on my phone? What the fuck are you talking about? I don't even know what, why. What are you mentioning anything? What are you talking about? You want me to that again? What are you even, what are you talking oh, about? Oh, don't try to lie to me, you fucking idiot. You what are you this? even here for? What are you here for? What do you want? What do you, do you really, want? Do you really think about the lies before Why you lie? Why are you even around? You even the know? lies about what? What the fuck are you the talking about? The fact that you're telling me I'm crazy and I follow you, but you fucking- Because you are! Me. You called me saying, oh, you still live in Massachusetts? What are you talking what are you, about? What do you mean when I'm talking about, you fucking what idiot? What the fuck is this shit talking about? The phone? The phone? The Why are you even around? What do you want? What are you, you here for? CJ, I just want you to tell me the truth. The truth about what? What is this girl even on about? I don't even know what she's talking what about. What the fuck is this about? I don't know. I'm fucking just as confused as you. Oh, bullshit. I'm I'm he sounds caught. He sounds caught. He sounds caught. CJ's terrible. His mom's are doing this to me when I don't even know what the fuck she's talking about. Oh, really? Then why'd you text me? Literally. What, what, like, why, what did my moderators yeah. do to you that I should have told, told oh, them? That wow. I should have been like, hey, listen, That's you okay. should have done this. And by the way, the stillborn thing, can you prove she did that? Can you prove it? It's prove already it to her. Tell it's me, and, and, and then tell me what I should done. do about it. It's already on my page. All you got to do is go look. It's like out there. Okay, what should I do about it then? So I'm not even sure how much of the story I want to tell, but it's in this live stream if you want to know. Apparently, I don't know everything, but from what I heard when I was checking it out off and on earlier, CJ or a mod or somebody shared pictures of something very devastating. Um, it's awful. So that's what the other person's mad about. I know that. I don't want to talk about it because it's it's sad, it's triggering, and it's I just don't want to. Um, so it's there if you want to check it out. He sounds caught, you guys. I'm sorry. Whatever's going on, he sounds caught. And why is it he never knows what anybody is talking about? Whenever anybody has a problem, he says, I don't know what you're talking about. If everybody has a problem with you doing something, like, eventually you have to realize you might be the problem. Hey, AZ. Okay, I'm, I'm muted. I'm going back. Yes, yeah, Stacks. It's sad. Oh, CJ's in the chat. CJ, what is... I don't even know. I don't even know. I'd be like, tell me the truth. Like, I, I, I don't nothing care. Either, so what, what I do I care? I just want to know. I don't care. CJ, you piece of shit. Did you do this shit? If you did, no. okay, just tell me straight up. If you didn't, okay. Either no, way. I don't, I don't know what she's talking about. Don't lie to me. It, like, why is she so convinced that this happened, CJ? I don't know. Girl, like, you're dealing with a liar that's been known to lie to people, like, in the worst ways. CJ is fucked in the head. I, I honestly think to myself sometimes, he, does he know in that he's lying way. when he lies? <laughs> Because literally, it's no, so... No, I don't know what I don't know I'm lying. So, Inferno, <laughs> from what I saw, how this started was MFW talked about CJ a few times, then she had this person on, and CJ started going off in the chat, kind of like he's doing here and adding comments, and then eventually they were just like, okay, come up. So they shared the link. Um, let CJ up. I don't know. It's up to the chat. It's up to the chat. It's I don't want to make anybody uncomfortable. Um, I don't know. The way he carries on screaming from what I heard was kind of scary during this. 
So I don't know how comfortable I am having CJ up, to be honest. I don't know how comfortable I am with that. And CJ, you know what you wrote to me that made me extremely uncomfortable. And no, I don't want to go on your panel. I'll just say it here. <laughs> I, Yeah, Carly, CJ, I don't know. I, I get a very bad feeling. And this is nobody else telling me anything. This is my own intuition and the way you behaved because I didn't write you back. You seem like, I don't know, like everybody owes you something. And from what I saw in here, you had a big problem with MFW having this person on. Why do you care? You and MFW don't even work together anymore. So I'm saying my own thoughts on you because I know you thought you could come in here and shout out comments. Every time I see you and somebody says they have a problem with you, you always, I don't know what you're talking about. It's you, not me. I did this. Like, if everybody has a problem with you, eventually you have, might have to realize you're the problem. I'm not letting him up. My intuition tells me to stay the F away. Like, I don't mind if you want to come in here and say your side or whatever, but like, I have no intentions of talking to you outside of what I'm saying right here. No, I'm not taking the bait. Like, just let us react. Like, don't ruin our good time. I'm not in the mood. I'm tired. I've had a long day. Like, I have to take my dog to the vet tomorrow. I'm not in the mood. So, CJ, if you want to start trouble, I don't know what to tell you. And that's all I have to say about that. Hey, Jack. Hey, Mikhail. You're fucking stupid. At least yeah. I yeah. know that motherfucker <laughs> goes around and fucks a girl after she says no twice and she's a lesbian. Oh, you're, okay. You're, 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 Okay. Well, how come she came up and admitted it was a bullshit story then? How come that happened? I fucking bullied her for years. Dude. I bullied her even though I never you talked did. to her. It makes you sense. You about her for fucking years. Oh almost God. daily. Daily, God, dude. Do you just have and a then you script? You just do the same way. thing every time you and come around. And then when around, you send people her way, out and boring. This is so boring. Yeah, it's not chachi. It's my 15-year-old. You fed her fucking alcohol on your age. What the fuck is going on? CJ, what the fuck is going on? Yeah, what is going on? a fucking moron on your stream? You mean someone who That's can tell... It. There you go. Someone who can I tell the truth. Else to say. <laughs> are you all right? Like, you you are, like, seriously are you fucked. All right? You should get some fucking mental help. You should get some mental help, dude. You should get guys, yourself checked guys, in somewhere. Guys, you're so fucking weak that you have to sit there and what? Mental health? Are you crazy? Yeah, go get What I write, help. Danny? You need help. Okay, so you help guys... Every time I start to watch the documentary done on CJ, every single time I watch it, I try to watch it. It's like <laughs> something always comes up. So I don't know the whole situation. I know somebody was drinking underage, apparently. That's all I really know. That's all I, That's all that I've really established from it. I still have to watch it and get my own my own point of view on it because I don't want – I'm not the kind of person who's going to let somebody tell me and just take that as that. Like I need to do my own research. Um, but I will say, like, I don't appreciate him coming in here to try and start trouble. Like, he was flat out. Uh, you know what? That's all I have to say. Like, he made me very uncomfortable in a DM, <laughs> all because I didn't reply. And then to come in here acting like, I don't know, it's just, it's annoying. I get a horrible feeling, just a bad feeling. So I don't even know. I don't even know. Watch and tell you, I will irate Danny. She had a mental breakdown as he coached her live. Oh my gosh. I don't know, A, but I didn't appreciate him coming up in here and all that. Like, yeah, I'm streaming about it. Like, he doesn't have to come start problems. I mean, he came on here acting a fool on, on that panel because <laughs> I don't even like MFW. And like, I remember when I was watching the bits and pieces, I'm like, why does he care who she has up? Like, why, like, does she owe him something? She can't have other people up? Um, no, Casey, girl, you're not blocked. Just from the way I was talked to and the way the person made me feel because I didn't reply, I got everything I needed to know and knew I was never going on a panel. Um, the documentary, yes. Hold on, let me see. I got to find it again. 
Give me one second and I'll, do you guys want me to press play while I look for it and then I'll link it in the chat? Um, all right, I'm gonna hit play, I'm gonna look for it. Get off, Get off the drug, yeah, yeah, I know, I, I know. I okay. What are you here for? No, you Brandy, you're not black. from this interaction, I'm curious. I don't gotta tell you shit. What do you want from this? I don't want anything from this. So why are you here? Because I want to be. <laughs> <laughs> CJ. Yeah, what's up? Tell me the truth. What the fuck is going on right now? I wish I could tell you, Katie, but there's really... I can't explain crazy to you, so... So that's, are you really trying to play dumb, CJ? Really? Wait, what are you even talking about? What, do you see what, what you, I'm saying? She what am I talking no about? Sense. Are you fucking insane? What do you oh mean? Oh, my God. Bro. Get some fucking help. You need help. Yeah, yeah, I know. I know. So, is there anything else I can help you with? Do you need anything else? What else? What else? What else? You came on there. Her money. <laughs> her money back. She needs her money. That you, oh, wow. She needs her money. She needs whatever you owe her. She was paid. By the way, yeah, Emma. The public apology for being lied on. He didn't end up paying me up. Do you want? Do you, so what the fuck? So shut the fuck up. Like, no, I'm not going to shut the fuck up. Not you, Katie. Not you, Katie. You're talking about her. For you to pay them back. CJ. Yes. Tell me the truth. What is going on here? Do I don't know, know Katie. I, I you let a moron onto your stream. I don't know. This. I don't even what know. What the fuck she's, is this? She's she's just going on about nothing. She's Can I just point out that these two were talking, just talking about whatever, because they're allowed to talk about whatever they want on MFW's channel. Again, I hate that I'm put in the position to de defend MFW. But why does she have to tell him who she's bringing on? And then he's on there. Can I help you with anything else? Like you came up and butted it on their conversation. <laughs> uh, Minka, I want to read your comment. Hold on. I'm scrolling back up to see if I can find it. Minka said, I was around. Hold on. Is there a text? Is there a message before that, Minka? So Minka said, um, I was around immediately after that. He set up my autistic friend to be attacked, a former content creator. I wasn't going to say anything, but she still gets crap because of him. Oh, my gosh. Well, I'm sure she did this for attention. Like, MFW does everything for attention. CJ, at this point, I think you're all crazy. Do you want to know my real opinion? I think it's weird that you guys keep breaking up, yet keep talking to each other and keep starting crap with each other. Like, you cannot act like you're sitting here with your hands clean. Like, you guys said you weren't going to do a podcast anymore. And then you're up in here. You're in the chat commenting, check your text, call me, to all that other stuff. Like, stop acting like your hands are clean. Um, Lily CJ is the one. In the lowest square, he used to be friends with Peanut and Negs, I think. Inferno said, CJ, we still have to give this a rundown fully. A lot of us are watching it from the opening here, so we need more time for the bits to show and set in. Yeah, we haven't seen everything. But CJ, to sit here and act like everybody else is the problem, like what part do you play in this? Like, don't act like you're all innocent. She's going, She's going on, on about nothing. About nothing. She's an ex-mod ex we kicked out of the community, so she's trying to, like, uh, go around and act like fucking... Okay, no, like, broke right. up as far as working <laughs> together, <laughs> Heidi. She keeps, she keeps trying to get moderators, like, she keeps trying to, you know, I don't like, give a fuck about moderators your out. I don't give a fuck do. what anybody else does. It has nothing to do with me. I don't uh, care. Okay. And then she just keeps she talking about old shit that's already been proven false. It's annoying. The fact that CJ's she's here fighting his ass off. It tells me a lot. What the No, fuck? it's not. No, I'm just here because I, I don't understand why you would let somebody on like this on your fucking hey, screen. Hey, dropping you're clips. You're smarter than this. She's having open panel. panel. You're not you're a fucking idiot. Why does she have to tell you who she's having on panel? Like, why do you have a say in who she has on her own channel? Didn't you guys stop working together? Again, I hate that I'm even sticking up for her. I cannot stand her for the life of me. I am. I don't, I don't know. I don't know, I don't what, know to do. what to do. I don't know who to I don't believe. know who to believe. Did you just call me an idiot? Did you just call me an idiot? Because I'm about to call you out. So I would leave the chat 
I would run because now you're annoying me. So go. <laughs> Please, now. Oh my gosh, Miguel, really? <laughs> I know sometimes I tell, well, I haven't told my mom about all this stuff, but like I used to, talk, my mom and I used to talk about like the foodie booty stuff and when like Jessica Mesca stuff was going on and the garlic bread and everything, she'd come home and like drive over here and be like, so what happened today? And we would gossip about it. So now she checks in on everybody's channel. Yeah, he talks down to women. Exactly. Okay, if he's calling me an idiot, good thing I bit my tongue then. Happy PCJ, you calling me an idiot? I think that was directed at me because I called it original. I don't know if you were you calling me an idiot. If you weren't, then we're we're not okay. But I mean, if you're, I I took it the wrong way. But either way, I find it odd that you're in here after your little dramatic thing that you had going on. Like I, now he's playing stupid. Carlos, I don't care. Go away. <laughs> Go away. This it's not about. It's not believing. about believing. It's about. It's just about knowing just that knowing that. So you did call me an idiot. You, know, you are, are having these, these, right. these bad really bad behaviors. Bye, Carlos. Okay? You might get, you might to, get to, fool get to fool people ever so often, ever so often until they find out who you are. But eventually, that fail always falls. And you know that. that just as well as I do. That's why your channel has never gotten over thirty-five to forty thousand, no matter how hard you work. Because point. There you go. Tell him. That's fine to say that. You're all. What are you talking about? You're always talking about how you're big platform. Oh, I'm not going to mention Listen, my channel is not a my channel is not a big platform. I'm a fucking nobody. What are you saying talking that now about? because you're around someone who actually made no, their because that that is the reality. My channel is not some big channel. I'm a fucking now. nobody. I'm a fucking now. nobody. You're around someone who's actually had a successful channel. What? What are you talking about? Let me see if I can fix it. Katie, have I ever tried to act like I'm some? Okay, let me see if I could fix it. Sometimes it does that. Hey, Lauren. <laughs> Good to see you. Hello, fellow insomniac. I, I, um, I put it in the chat. Did it not come up? I wasn't the one who started the situation. All I know is from what I saw, they were talking and you, you, did, you had to get your two cents in there and butt in and cause a... Um, Dax... Oh, you do? I have a DM from you? Okay, hold on one second. I don't see a DM. Uh, hey, Lana. Okay, I'll share the documentary again. Give me a second. Um, and CJ, if you'd stop like distracting so I have to stop and address you, I, I could try and understand the situation. Breezy, good to see you, but in on something you don't know anything about. Well, if you'd let us watch this, and why do you, like, why do you bring chaos wherever you go? Carlos is in here defending you. Like, it's just weird. CJ, tell us what happened so we can hear both sides because rape is effing unexcusable. Exactly. All right, I'm hitting play. Big, big fucking YouTuber. What is this shit even talking about? What do you mean, what am I talking about? When have I ever been like, oh, I'm, I'm fucking successful? I'm Every so single time. Told Katie that she used you, dude. When, when said, the falling out she happened, used me. We just started falling out over fucking used, money because I was sick of hearing about money publicly. She said that she used you, and you're the one who clearly used her because you can't pull. No, you know what? You know what bothers me about Katie is I. I you know what bothers me about Katie though, Katie. I I stuck my neck out. I stuck my neck out. You used her, and you have the audacity to do what you do to most people when you fucking what are you talking about? Aside, you sit there oh and you say, God. "Oh, hey, you gotta kick this shit." She's, she's a fucking cloud chaser. She's crazy. You're a fucking incel with baby hands. You yeah, I'm them. an incel. How, well, how come an incel be getting nudes? Then how can you send an incel nudes? That makes sense. You fucking moron. Uh, because wow. because you said you do, dude. You're a fucking idiot. You're a Thank you, Danny. Seriously, seriously you make no sense. You know what an incel can you share it in here? Really? You know what an incel is? Oh uh, yeah, absolutely. What is and it? You What's an incel? Like, Why do you want to fucking incel then? Why do you want to fucking incel? You do get intimidated idiot? by strong women. You always have. But yeah, I'm intimidated. Out. Yeah, you're you real like intimidating. I don't know. You you're like the real game. intimidating. You like you're a joke. Game. It's fucking funny. You're, weird. you're like the fucking weird game. What? 
You like the weird game of being what, what are you talking about? You're, you're so confusing. Crazy. What is this shit even talking okay. about? What are you going on about? about? Who knows that shit about you. It's hey, what is she crazy. talking about? You I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm vaping too, Heidi. She's talking in circles. You've got a harem of women who have come after me ever since I have fucking fucked with you. Um... She seems really convicted that you fucked her over. She wasn't fucked over. Oh, yeah. I was. Danny, 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 I just... Oh, my, oh my gosh. Right, you boys gotta have one. Danny, I just blocked you on accident. Hold on. I don't know how to... I was trying to block Carlos. Oh, my gosh. Danny, I am so sorry. As soon as this ends, I don't know how to unblock you. Does anybody... <laughs> I don't know how to do it on live. Um... Oh man, Danny, I'm so sorry. I know. Okay, Minka unblocked you. Danny, please type so I know you're here. I am so sorry. Carlos, like, why do you even need to be here? Like, nobody cares about you. We're trying to watch a panel, and you and your friend are really distracting. So, like, I didn't do anything to you. You're just really annoying. I want to see you vote in the community. Hey, Lily. I know, Carlos, go to bed. You're delusional. Are you excited that you're on this stream right now? Do you think you're going to, like, just going to make your channel pop or something? Is that why you're here? Oh, let me mute so there's no. You understand that Katie's, like, look, you understand that I'm nobody, Katie's nobody, we're not anybody. This is not it for you. This is not a big deal. This is not special. This is like really fucking dumb. And like, the only person here? your mind ever goes there is you because that's how you're No, it's you. You just said that my channel growth and I'm, I'm an incel. Like, what? You're the one who said everything about that. I came here to say, yo, oh hey, your situation, your story with yeah. the money situation is very similar to about seven What other money women. situation? What are you talking about? She was paid. Oh, the way the you lied about her about? The money situation, you piece of shit. She the was paid. You she was... With that. The way oh you lied God. about Katie. that with Harvard Katie, Katie, you were paid, right? Katie, and yeah. everybody else that you borrowed. So what are you talking about? What are you talking about? I mean, for God's sake, you psycho little shit. talking about? You should clean up your act and stop being some sloppy shithole on the internet. This is fucking funny. You okay, what else? What else should I do? What else should I do? Tell you me more about me. me for literally everything. Tell me more about me. This girl, CJ. No, I didn't. No, I've never met her in real life. Actually, thank God. CJ. Thank God. Thank God. Every week. She wanted to go to the I just remembered yeah, something. Oh my God. Out. One of the times I fell asleep listening to the documentary. Not that it was boring. I've just I'm like tired all the times so I try and listen to it. I remember waking up to a part that was like. He was talking to another mod named CJ and she was married and he was going to fly her out. And then they got into a huge, huge, huge falling out too. CJ, but why do all your mods say you want to F them? Like really, like, I'm just saying like, you act like you're innocent and your hands are clean. Like if everybody's saying you're doing the same thing, stop trying to F your mods. I don't know. Okay. I'll check it um, in a minute, Dax. So you're, gonna, you're gonna make me release like all your messages where you're asking. I have me, like, the videos up. I have, I have it. Thank you, Danny. Videos. You can go look it up. Look it up. You're, you're gonna, gonna literally make we me release that. all that's from years ago, you stupid. Fuck. Oh, so you you're admit it. You did try to set me up. She just admitted it, Katie. Messages. You're she just admitted it. All your she just admitted it. And your fucking ass pictures and shit. Katie, she just admitted it. She literally just admitted it. No, this you're, you're talking about to. something from years ago. Like, <laughs> Did she admit it, you guys? You're, you're, you're going to make me put out your fucking text messages for me. What are you guys saying? Do you want that? Receipts are in your house. Receipts are in your house. Receipts are in your house. Do you really want that? Everybody. Oh, I have the video. I'll get it for you. Hold on. I'll send it to you, Katie. Yes. Hold on. I'll be sending you my videos as well. I'm at work right now, but when I, as soon as I get off, I'll send it to you, all right? Oh, okay. Yeah, I'll make nice. sure to have my shit. Actually, sent no, when I get off stream, I'll send it to you. It's all good. But yeah, you got to oh, oh, Thank you, Hippie. I'll post it now. It's okay. Good night, Aaron. What Did I not tell you? Did what I threat? What threat? The, oh, on my stream. On my stream. 
alluding to any fact. I said I'll, I said I'll send it to you when I get off stream. Oh, I thought you said I thought you said on stream. That's my bad. You, you should enunciate what? better. Why would I? Why would I? Why would I want to stream about you? Uh, because you have. I don't know. Answer uh -uh. that question. Hey, I just want to make it very clear. I think this all sounds crazy. Carlos, I know, but I can't get both sides when you and CJ are being so distracting. I have to keep pausing to address you guys. Like, come on now. Like, you know what you're doing. I think everybody sounds crazy. I think this is all a lot. I think everybody plays a part in something on this panel. I don't know what, but if she's really following them to communities, I don't know. But wouldn't he rather ignore her than get on here and engage? Like somebody right now is saying some of the worst crap about me in their community posts and I'm ignoring because I realize me engaging is going to make things a thousand times worse and I know the truth, so who cares? Like, and two, these male creators, I just want to say using their platform and sleeping with people, their audience or all this other stuff, like, why? Like, if everybody's saying you're trying to F them, like, <laughs> I don't know. I'm just saying your hands aren't clean, clearly. Yeah, and he's screaming at women, like, get it together, you know? I don't know. Like, you're not going to come in here and convince me that it's everybody else and not you. I'm saying everybody needs to look at what part they're playing in this, right? Not really. 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 This is on your fucking channel. What? What did you say? What? So, well, show it, CJ. Well, I'll send it to you. I can't right now. I only have my phone. I'm at work. I, 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 to be honest, I shouldn't even be here. But anyways, like, you're dealing with a fucking moron who tried to set me up when I was going to Holly on Deads like three years ago. We gave her a chance to come back to the community. She freaked <laughs> out again, so we banned her. And now she's mad at moderators because she, she thinks that Somebody put her stillborn child, which no, I, I don't think my mother really Yes, did nightmare, if accountability. I, if my mother really, really did that, I'd, I'd remove that from the community. I would never let a mod do anything like that. So I think it's a troll because there's a fake me running around. There's a fake Katie her, running around. So her. I think it's just a fake person trying to stir shit up. And Katie. this idiot is like, I don't know. It could be her fault. I don't fucking know. He just was on a live show or you're a goddamn liar. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'll I'll video video so can we just yeah, chill a bit? The girl that he's, he's talking about with the stillborn photo is literally on a live stream saying, I quote. She told me she would never do on, that. I just talked to her that night. I'm going to... Oh, whatever sorry. the bitch is... Okay. Whatever she say, prove to me that she's a liar and I will forgive you for everything. <laughs> what do you mean? Prove, it, prove to you that she's a liar about what? What do you mean? You've been, you You've been calling her a liar, right? I know you weren't being set up, you dumb fuck. You said you wanted to set me up. You said you that wanted to say that I raped you. You, you oh, wanted to tell you. people that I raped you. That's what you said. No, you literally no, really? admitted it. Where's that proof? Where's that proof? You literally admitted yeah. it. Every, look, oh, no, oh my no, God. No, I can't. This chick is a fucking piece of shit. I was saying. You are a complete piece of shit. I was talking your victim and it fucking pissed you off. You're a piece of shit. You're a piece of shit. There's, there's no victim. Thank you, Carlos. People use me like, listen. You're a piece of shit. People use me for my community. Like, listen, if they don't like you, they're not gonna. Katie, Katie, this girl's using me for right now. Because I'm getting really upset. She's using you. She's using you. Look, Katie, I'm being real with you. I'm being real with you. She's using you right now. Railroading. You're being, you're being used because you're drunk and she knows she can. There you go. I'm not drunk, CJ. Wow. You're drunk. 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 you are drunk 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 you no proof. There's proof. At least, no, Heidi. Are you trying to say that I told her to do that? At you least. Know, say, even if you can somehow all. prove that, that she did that, I'm are you trying to say I told her to do it? Then why do I care? I don't know. Why do you care? I don't know. I'm, like, lost. Why do you keep bringing up this you random shit? And why are you even up? here? I'm lost on all of it. You literally texted me. It's just so confusing. 
and lie. You see, you, Kate, Kate, did you see like how she keeps jumping from story to story? What is she even you talking about? Story to story. You keep trying to tell everybody I was trying to set you up for some rape thing. No, I was. No one's even story. trying to talk about you. You came talking, here to talk about yourself. Talking. I was talking to your. When did I bring you up recently? When did I bring you up recently? You came up here to talk about yourself. Uh, a day ago, yesterday. <laughs> did I bring you up? Did I did I do a stream about you? Literally, did I title a stream I about said, you? You asked if you brought me up. You have brought me up. Wait, did I do a stream about you? Did I actually title a stream about you? Did uh, I say, hey, tear toddies or whatever the fuck, and said anything about you like that? Literally, no. We're also in my DMs, but that's okay. What are you, you were texting, you were messaging me, and I was like, I, I don't want to say. I was like, that has nothing to do with me. I was like, let it go. I said, let the stuff of Raina go, let the stuff of JLF go. You just can't, and now you're here. You just oh, don't no, let shit go. Talking about this subject? Yeah, you were talking about what? this subject. Don't try to twist it. It's all right. You're, no, you're I said, let it go. I said, let it go. Down there. Yeah, let it go. I said, let it go, and you let can't let it go. go. This is why let you're here. Go. Let it go. I can't. This is pretty annoying, dude. This is, this is. Oh, my gosh. I think he ends up coming on again, but I love it that he's saying let it go, but having to get that last word. <laughs> Why doesn't he jump, go, and move on? He loves his negative attention. I think, well, Katie's loving the attention too. Let's just be honest. Like, they're all playing a part right here. It's a lot of it's for attention, but it's all like everybody pointing the finger. And CJ, like I said, like you need to take accountability. Like, it's the lack of taking that and the way you talk to women and the way you're very pushy it's very off-putting at the 20 minute mark on that doc with amber okay so that's when it starts at the 20 minute mark okay um yeah katie wanted this like come on like that's why i say everybody plays a part like katie knew talking about it was probably gonna get cj upset but then cj is taking the bait in the chat typing all these comments and then now he's on here screaming about how like why is she following him let it go like you're engaging with her do you realize that like a lesson i had to learn and i haven't been on youtube as long as you like i said somebody is literally saying like some of the creepiest stuff about me right now and like i cannot engage i cannot do community posts if they choose to do a live stream i cannot be in there i know what they're saying is a lie and why am i gonna like why you know um, is Carrie in here? Carrie, we react to you. So <laughs> I love watching your videos. Hi, good to see you. Like, look, I'm going to be honest, honest Katie, you're wasting your time with this. I'm wasting my time with this. circles. Literally nobody, you're wasting your time. Oh yeah. Uh, you would be scared. You're wasting your time. You would be. Yeah, I'm really scared. I'm really scared. Yeah. You know who I know. I'll, back, I'll bring Yeah, I'm very, back. I'm very scared. I'm, I'm very scared. Everybody should be very scared. You're very scared. And you should be. If you want anybody I'm very, to- I'm, I'm going to pack up my channel and I'm going to leave the internet oh, forever said. because of you. Oh, I you're know very you're scary. not. It's all you live for. It's all you you're live for. Scary. Everybody you're very scary. I'm very scared. You're, you're, Katie, she's scary. You should be scared. No, I'm not scary. But the things that you've done are You scary. are scary. No, you're fucking crazy. What are you here for? <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> what an insult. Yeah, I know. How come you want a fucking insult? <laughs> What the fuck? Oh my gosh. <laughs> it was oh, got weird. It's been weird, but. Are you guys in love? No. I think she's in love. She's definitely in love with me. That's the CJ, are you, are you in love? He messaged me on the fifth. He messaged you know me on the fifth. Okay, Carlos. You still in Massachusetts. Can I call you? He called me back to back three times. Oh my gosh. Three times? It's all crazy. I know. How many times? Three times. Three times, huh? Yeah, I've already got a fucking incel. What's up with that? Hi, Raven. Oh my god, what the fuck is wrong with you? Do, do, what the fuck is wrong with you, dude? You said new dude. Sarah, I I still am not even sure <laughs> what, what her name is. is. What's wrong with you? Do you, 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 you ever say? Hold on. Is this what this is about? Did we ever find out who this chick was again? I don't even remember her name after all this. I think I've just been calling her this chick or that chick. I don't know who she is. Can somebody tell me right now? <laughs> oh, really, Heidi? Oh, my gosh. Wow. Um, hi, Night Owls. Yes, Insomniac crew in here. It was Tate or something. Her name's Tate or something? Okay. Um, Carlos, if you want to send a link of any videos you want us to check out, I mean, feel free to um, so we can get, you know, make our own minds up, get our own opinions on it. Is this what this is about? Tater something. News and dick pics? 
This it's okay, Carlos. We're good. Triangle. Here we go. <laughs> Absolutely. No. Katie, listen. No. It's okay. Sounds like it, Rally, but Tater Top. I am doing a stream, yeah. Well, you are in love with this girl. And it's totally fucking obvious to me. A CJ. You know, CJ, I probably would have pity fucked you if you weren't so fucking creepy about it. Oh I my God. It, messaging me every fucking week. You want to come fuck me? You want to come fuck me? You want to come fuck me? I probably would have had you not been so damn desperate, dude. At least he's consistent. That's part of his charm. <laughs> True. I mean, at least he's consistent. You know what I mean? Consistent or I was still laughing. Maybe both. Whatever. CJ, he's. What are you doing? I'm working. What are you doing? No, you're not. He's not working. I him. I actually am working right now. Come in, oh, what? Defend me, bitches. You, you better, better defend, defend me. Chris, good to see you. Okay, can Bye. we talk about that At for a Omar. second, Chris? Um, she looks good with her hair any color than blonde, like the brunette. I have to say that. Oh, her name's Taylor. The brunette. And like, this kills me because I do not like Miss Effing Wonderful. I do not like her. But she looks really good with darker hair. Hey, Rudy. He's not working. Yeah, I don't know. He always says he's working. What does he really do? Uh, this is motherfucker's obsessed with you. you. She, she likes you. I know. know. Yeah. Yes, I know. Oh, I wow. Know wow. <laughs> you know you Katie, do. You figured this out, huh? You figured this out, huh? Oh, oh wow! Yeah. It took me about forty-five minutes to do this. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh wow! 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 Ugh. Can we just like okay? Does that make you upset, Taylor? Does right that here. make you upset that she knows what's going on now? What the fuck? Does that upset you? Does that upset you no. that she knows what's going on? You're fucking. You're an embarrassment, dude. That's what it is. Yeah. Tell me more about me. You're a fucking embarrassment. Tell me more about me. Have you ever hit it in real life? No, 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 no. I have. Thank God. Thank God. I mean, what do you mean you good. have? I'm not what do you mean? Not what do you mean? <laughs> Don't you even start making that rumor up. Okay, Did stop. she just say I have? I, I don't know. She said I stop have. It. I knew you just said that about next. Play it out. Stop and it. you know it's true too. You stop, stop it. Stop lying. Did she stop say I have? Cut it out. Stop it. I don't believe that. I don't believe. I don't believe that you fuck Mike. I don't believe you at all. You're a fucking big old fucking titty, CJ. You've always been a big old fucking titty. All right, then I'll lie. What? 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 You, a big old titty? You've always, always been, been a big, big old boob. boob. A boob. What? You're so damn sensitive. CJ, are you going to take this from her? I don't <laughs> even, I can't take this seriously anymore. I can't. MFW, wait. wait. And yeah, I'm in, so, yeah. I know, okay, we have to talk about this, Danny. Okay, I know MFW said her and Negs hooked up, but Negs and DC that say that didn't happen. Did she really hook up with CJ, too? Because she said, I have. That's what she said. She said, I have. Yeah, she called him a boobay. Eh? She called him a big old titty. <laughs> yeah. Katie was trolling about Negs. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, I, I don't know, because I think she said that they did it when she was, um, what was she, like over 400 pounds or something? I don't know, but I wish I didn't have the mental image I have in my head right now. I really wish it would go away. <laughs> oh, she's joking about CJ. I mean, yeah, I hope I hope so. Yeah, I'm yeah, never been named. I'm an intern. I know. I know. Oh, we know. CJ. <laughs> Around a little bit. Side, side, oh, really, Danny? I have so much to learn. <laughs> Why? Okay. Because I saw that this was actually happening, and I'm I'm just shocked. Like I I've never I've never seen you let on a moron like this before. I've never seen it. I'm why I'm you just know, so surprised. You know, she let you on. You're a fucking moron. 
Well, I mean, there was some money involved in it, so that kind of makes sense. I mean, to be real. I mean, okay, but I was a friend of you who gave you money when you needed it, and you just—I gave you money too, you stupid bitch. Oh, yeah, like, oh, yeah, yeah, that's right. I, 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 Whoa! Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. Whoa! Let me ask you a question, by the way. How did listen, listen, listen? You're straight. Listen, hold on, hold on. Answer the question. Until answer I have to put out my bank God statement. Damn. That's how hard you write qu- on me with that. Can Until you, I like, okay, literally okay. go through okay. and put out. Oh my God. My bank okay. statements. So yeah, 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 yeah. I'm I'm gonna get to that. Okay. So you had to let out PayPal statements, right? You're saying I owed you money, bank but at the before, well, hold on, hold on, hold and Google transaction statements. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. But everything you won't I gave do you, for but, Katie, everything you couldn't before, do for Katie because you lie and like a motherfucker. Katie, Katie did true, I give you the you money? You don't have to really think too hard about it. Katie, did I give you the money? Which I'm time? talking about the screenshots. Of did I give you the money for the podcast? No, you, she asked for screenshots before you gave her the money of the transparency, CJ. And that's what I you gave made her screenshots. Do. What, are you talk, what are you talking about? Oh, no, you didn't. And it's not that hard. It's not that hard to scribble out some shit in your bank that you don't want people to see. It's not that hard to scribble out some shit in the Google transactions. And I did that, by the way. Anyway, so, so you're trying and to say no, that no, I owed you money, anyway, right? Motherfucker. Okay, not so anyway, you're trying to say I owed you money, but how can you borrow money from me, pan. right? But, and you gave me the money back. Why did you give me the money back? I gave you Why did you give me the money back? But I showed that to you. I showed this that to you, dumbass. So, so since I brought, since you borrowed money from me, and, you and I owed you at the same time, from me that okay, you didn't but what's this? Katie, you, you know how when somebody like, like they, 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 this isn't the first creator that I've heard loans people money. Like, why? I heard another creator does that too, and there was a all these people that came out about him loaning them. Like, why? Like, it's just messy. Like. I've made some stupid mistakes online, but like these people take the cake. Community, and all of a sudden they give you donations and they say, Oh, you owe me that donation. It is wild, Lauren. Oh, no, that's really sad because the second I left, you're the one who started spreading shit about money, and I had to defend myself. I have the screenshots. No, I didn't. Track. No, I didn't. I didn't say anything. Yeah, I never even said that. Yeah, he did. You. You're you on you chain. Oh, yeah, he this. did. That's fine. I've got the screenshots. I put them with the bank statements. You fucking yeah, dumbass. That, that, pay, that PayPal shit is bullshit. You're that's not real. It's not just PayPal, it's oh my, my bank account. You dumb fuck. Like, I can't, I can't entertain this for much longer. This is like, like a serious waste of time, Katie. We are we gonna like? What's going on here? Like, are there any questions or like? Are you calling her an alcoholic? I'm not calling her an alcoholic. I said she was drinking. You Being did. drunk is not. Call, I'm not calling her a drunk. I said she was drinking. You called her an alcoholic all over your stream, and then you're on, you're on here calling her an alcoholic, but you don't well, want to. She said I was a junkie and I was on the needle, which is very offensive, Katie. It kind of depends. Oh. It makes me really sad. <laughs> you guys all need to knock that crap off. Everybody addict shaming and come on. There's a difference between calling somebody out or saying, hey, I know you're not really sober or hey, you st- <laughs> you're supposed to be sober and you're doing this or hey, look at what you're doing. Like this isn't good behavior when you're under the influence or hey, you're scamming for booze or drugs. Like I get calling somebody out, but like all you people pointing the finger at each other, like somebody, oh my gosh, Some, someone was has been addict shaming me nonstop and it turns out they're an addict. Like just stop, stop it. You call MFW a drunk, an alcoholic, say she's drinking. She calls you a junkie. Like, come on. Like, it's crazy. That's what I'm saying. These people that are like, I don't get it. Like they all lack accountability. Everybody's like pointing the finger and you did this, you did this. And like, oh my gosh. It's wild. It's wild to me. And yeah, who needs who needs cable? Like, I should just cancel all my streaming apps and everything. Like this, you could just watch this. Below deck, who? Housewives, what? Like, I'm watching this every night. People all the time. What? Who gives a fuck? You offend people all the time. Your existence offends people. Doesn't you don't know. care. Makes me sad. Well, she is an alcoholic. You're not supposed to say somebody's an alcoholic, right? In recovery, we're not supposed to, like, diagnose and say. But, like, she says she is. She is an alcoholic. But people using it to hurt her, like, when they're possibly using or possibly not using or who knows. MFW keeps saying that. but And that's not cool if it's not true. But, like, everybody's shaming each other. And, like, none of their sides of the street are clean right now. Um, Carlos... No, but I I don't like that, Carlos. 
all these male creators saying, oh, all these women are just throwing themselves at me. I can't help it. All these women just want me and they're lying about me and they, they send me the nudes and they're DMing me and whatever excuses. Like, what part are you playing? Are you DMing back? Are you saying let's hook up? Are you trying to have sex with these people? Like, it's, come on. Like, at some point, these male cr creators need to be held accountable. Stop using your platform to sleep with everybody. And you know what I mean? I'm not saying all male creators, but we know which ones I'm talking about. Stop using your platform and trying to hook up with people. And then when you get caught cr screaming, everybody just wants me. I don't know what the, I don't know what's going on. Like, come on. Really? Okay. Wait, before we get back into this, just so you guys know, these late night streams, I'm more myself. I say what I want to say. I really don't hold back. So welcome. <laughs> During the day, I'm more reserved breezy. At night, I'm wild and sassy and free. So welcome. Hey, YouTube. You can call me an alcoholic. You can call me whatever. No, it's not all male creators, Inferno. Well, let's get down to we know the ones I'm talking I'm about. swap boxes well, gravy. At this point, you two need to be together. Maybe. Maybe, Chris. No. no. Yes. No. I'm good. I don't oh, I'll mute You're so there's no echo. Gonna, Sorry, you guys. Anything that another motherfucker better than y'all have told me before. An alcoholic? I'd rather be an alcoholic than a goddamn drug addict. Next. And I ain't even that drunk yet. I'm just sitting here listening I can't to stand, the stand blog, when she does that. Next. Here. I can't stand Whatever, it. Whatever, we all, right. all are. I, I gotta, I gotta go. I'm my yeah. cigarette I can't, I, and all I that. I can't keep entertaining this. I can't keep entertaining this. I gotta he's go. I gotta, I gotta go actually. All his 17,000 go. guys. He's a superstar. He can't entertain the drama. Yeah, I'm, yeah I'm, a, I'm a superstar. Hi, yeah, so, right? Yeah. You're a superstar, right? Real I'm streaming. A, I'm a fucking, I'm, I'm a literal you're nobody. Yeah, you're a wannabe. Yeah. You wanna be, you wanna be fucking, I don't even know what you wanna I'm gonna make another drink and these two fuckers are still gonna go at it. I, I, I will be the casualty, you know. You're oh, we good. cut out. You're good. He'll be back. Well, well see, it's, it's just, just I'm, I'm crazy. crazy. I'm, I'm the crazy, crazy one. I'm psycho. Oh, I, I tried to say. Okay, do we want to scroll through and see what else happens if he comes back? I want to say I thought he came back, but I don't know. I know there was a few times he left and came back. Um, yes, alcohol is an addiction and alcohol is a drug. Um, let's see. What do you mean, see, Carlos? No, not all male creators are male reactors. It's, yeah, it's all a personal issue. And I'm not saying all of them. I'm just saying we know which ones I'm talking about. And it's always the same old story. Like, oh, they all just threw themselves at me. I didn't look at the nudes. They sent me nudes. I haven't even opened them yet. We know, we know. <laughs> okay, so do you want me to skip through or should we just keep watching and see what happens? I kind of feel like we should take a two minute intermission. I'm gonna go get a vitamin water and a snack. Okay, two minute intermission. Yeah, he comes back. Okay, Danny, everybody go get your snacks, go get your water, pee, do what you have to do, let the dog out if you have to. I'll be right back.
Okay, are we ready? Press one if we're ready. Thanks, by the way, for waiting for me and everybody being here and hanging out. It's really good to see a lot of the familiar faces. It's good to see the new faces and the different creators. Thank you, you guys. Oh, <laughs> really shady bushy. <sighs> All right. Let's go. Uh, no, whatever. The, the shit with him, with him is, is, so is so fucking futile and redundant. Hey, Jamie. Hey, Jamie. I think I think you guys like each other. <clears throat> Why do you say that? <laughs> I have to know. Um, if it's been obvious, shit. I just sat back. It's obvious to everyone. CJ. <laughs> CJ, get your ass back up here. If you think this is a love debacle, put a one in the chat. <laughs> what do you guys think? Is it a one? <laughs> oh, <shit. laughs> oh, yeah. That's no, exactly, exactly what it is. Hold him up. Get him back on panel. If you don't believe this is a, a love, love debacle. debacle. Oh, she hates Minka. I mean, Minka, she, not she hates Minka, she hates CJ. Uh, yeah, look, look at all, all those ones. Oh, God. Well, well see, that's, that's just not how it is, is but, you know. He's, he's a little shithead, though. though. And, and he, he likes, likes it when I'm quiet. quiet. He, he likes, likes it when his past moderators don't say shit. I think so, too, Shady. He likes to, to scare us and, you know, say, well, we'll go this dirt on you or swing a little fucking narrative right to get us to kind of shut up well you fucked with a sagittarius dude uh-oh are you a sagittarius yeah yes she just said she was and what, what does that mean no that's mfw mm. well you know we're strong spirited we're strong willed and strong opinionated we don't back down and you know i'm a fire spirit so my element is fire we need to get Cake Boy up here. CJ! Come here. Come here, CJ. Don't run. run. Bring a moderator if, you, if it feels good for you to get some protection. I'm open to hearing both sides, Carlos. I like to I'm form my own opinion on things, but... No. Yeah, the drink's Drag kicking in, Moon. Fuck boy. I mean, he's a pussy-ass bitch. He hangs out with oh, like dang. fucking rattle cans. He has potential, but what he's doing now is like ruining himself in the public eye. And beyond that, he does have potential, though. Tragic, get your ass up on here. Well, and you know what hurts me, Katie? Hmm. It, CJ's up here saying this, like he faked it towards the end because you could hear him being the little condescending shit he is. Um, this makes him feel sad that he's like shocked about this. No, he's not sad about it. You know, what's really fucking sad is thinking you have a good friendship with someone and literally having them use you. And the second you want to take a step away from being a moderator, they shit talk you after all you've done for them. And he's not going to own everything I've done for him because he's he's I don't know. He wants to paint a narrative that I'm some fucking mean, vicious person. That's fine. But I know what I've done because he loves you. I was one of the biggest donators in his community. He had, had a friend, friend in me to come, come when he had falling out in finance. Okay. Because it's late and I am more honest than usual. I don't know why anybody hypes up tragic. I think that person is the most two-faced person I've ever seen on the internet. I think I've told you guys before, I've seen tragic literally sucking up to foodie beauty in a live. Like saying, let's collab on OF. And, da -da 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 -da. and then later when Nader was live, and like sometimes I would go just to read the chat, like I'd pause the video and not watch and just read the chat because I don't want to watch Nader. He'd be in there calling him like, hey, bro, yeah, you're the king, you're the man, you're this, you're that. He's so two-faced. Like he's so two-faced and he talks so much crap about Negs in DC and now wants to be besties with them again. I get people grow, people change, people go through stuff, but like I always see him being two-faced and that's how I view Tragic. Um, 
Yeah, I'm ignoring it, but like, I understand I need to hear both sides. I always do before I form an opinion. I always do what I need to do on my end so I can, like I said, form my own opinion, I guess. But I can't ignore how somebody made me feel. And I'm, I'm not going to like drag anybody or like expose or anything like that. I'm just going to say they know how they acted and treated me. It made me uncomfortable and I had a bad feeling about them from here on out. My opinion is not based on MFW or whoever this um, titter, titter tot, titty tot, whatever her name is, tater tot. <laughs> she was calling everybody a titty. So now I've called her titty tot. Um, but like, I feel how I feel for a certain way. And I've learned throughout my journey on YouTube, when somebody shows you who they are, believe them. Because before, I've always tried to ignore that and give people chances and say, oh, and try and see the best in people. But if somebody shows me who they are and treats me a certain way, I'm going to believe them. I'm going to believe Titty Tot. <laughs> Whatever her name is. <laughs> titty Tot. Totter Tot. I can't see it for some reason. Tootie Tot. I can't. <laughs> Whatever. Okay. I clearly need to go to bed soon. Let me hit play. And for this season life. And yeah, I did, I did borrow. borrow. I, think I think it was 35 bucks from him, but I paid him back immediately after he didn't have to badger me but he never paid me back he never said like you know I had a friend really help me out with this or pay me back even on his own and in fact I felt so bad for him I never asked him to pay me back and badgered him about it because I knew his financial situation was tough I kept all of his fucking dirt and fucking drama you clothes. asked him for 35 bucks yeah, in the end. And I paid him back and, you know, he badgered me for it. Paying him back. I asked him, like, yo, yo, can, can you spot me 35? I moderated for your chat today. I did a lot of uh, discord work, I believe is the context. And, uh, you know, I need to cut like a little gas cash. And he's like, yeah, no problem. No problem. And then so about two weeks later, he's just like, oh, yeah, yeah. Can you pay me back? Can you pay me back? I was like, sure. So I donated it to him 45 bucks on a live stream. He had an issue with that all the while borrowing $250 from me and never paying it back. So he had the audacity, audacity to, to lie, lie about, about that. that. The Again, I defend myself. DJ. Since when did YouTube become like a bank? Like, why are we loaning money and doing all that? Like, it's so messy. It's so messy. And like, I could say that because I did messy crap on here. I, I was like fake engaged to somebody who was like, <laughs> anyways, like, I've been messy, but, like, this is messy to a whole new level. Like, the whole borrowing, hooking up with everybody, like, getting way too personal with your mods. Like, I become friends. Like, I talk on Discord to, like, my mods and stuff like that. So, like, I'm friends with them on here and stuff like that. But, like, we're not loaning money to each other. I'm not trying to hook up with anybody. Like, we're good. <laughs> it's just so messy. Then they're so careless and messy and then it's like, it all blows up and they wonder why and they're all blaming each other. It's like, wow, wow. Get your, Get your ass, ass up, up here, here real, fast. real fast. And his defense, and his defense Katie, was, Katie, oh, was, oh you never, you you never, those, were you never those were donations. I never borrowed money from you. I was, wow. like, CJ, I was like, CJ, they, they weren't fucking donations. They were PayPal transactions. And he's like, oh, well, it says a donation. So I had to go through to my bank screenshot paypal the exact donations match up the dates match up the text match up his lies match up everything else match up the google transactions to, to differentiate Heidi. the different difference put that on a t-shirt Heidi. payment, payment and, a and a donation like the claim and he, and he never, never apologized, apologized never owned, owned that he lied, lied. Spread spread it around. Around. had to never pin that come the proof similar to how he's not acknowledging the proof that his moderator J Love was on a live stream threatening my stillborn daughter's photos as blackmail. And that's out there. Her voice. CJ. I don't know much how much more clear that can get. No, he didn't. He would never. Really? Now I'm not saying he did wow. that because I sent the photos to his moderator in wow. confidence during the time I was this is you know, bad. He, it was an appropriate topic for us to discuss this between two women with one another. And so I trusted her, but she tried to blackmail me with it, with them, 
the photos in confidence that I showed her. And he goes around and he's trying to say that I lied or that it's not, you know, I should let it go. He's not going to address it. His moderator did nothing wrong, even though her voice is out there. And no, he wouldn't do that. No, I CJ, get your ass up here right now. I have the text messages for real. No. This is. Yeah, yeah, sorry, Discord, Discord messages. He texted me, me and, and messages. Messages. This is so bad. Some of them are on Discord. Some, some of them are on text messages. messages. Yes. So, Carlos, so when he's saying, I'm who did it then? Test me, dude. I'm not. And, and if you really want all your shit out, dude, fine. But you're going to put me in that position where I have to because you're lying about me because you don't want to take accountability. Carrie, so, so true. Being someone who's so true, bees against BS. Doing that to someone because of petty moderator inner beef that's, that's what this boils, boils down, down to. to okay Doesn't carlos down have a good night suck your dick cj just like you think it's not or morning whatever it's not even close it's you spreading rumors lying about me lying about katie lying about you're gonna not know these names katie but i'm just gonna name them tush lori cj you again CJ, you better get your ass up here right now or i swear to god I i've about had it with you You're on my last nerve. I gave you a warning before and said if you were going to do this, you could either go or I'm going to block you or I'm going to say what I want to say. My true colors are I'm just trying to watch a video. You know, the channel that you went on and screamed at females. I'm just trying to watch it. You're going to cover me. CJ, you really need help. <laughs> you have done nothing but antagonize and start problems. So because you're not fighting with MFW anymore, you have to bother me. Yeah, Minka, I'm so... Ooh. I'm allowed to say, RSN... CJ, whatever the F your name is, I heard that you caught you stole a CJ name from somebody else, the person you were Fing, the married woman you were trying to fly out to you, you know, because that's all over the internet. What is your problem? You wanted me on your panel. I have been busy. No, 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 no. I'm going to say this, Bane. I have been busy. I have been busy and you got butt hurt and you said what you said and I said it to your face how you made me feel and that you needed to calm down. You're annoying. You're like a pesky fly at this point. I'm trying to swatch you away and you keep coming back. I'm literally just trying to watch this. Grow up. Go get a hobby. Go to sleep. And let me just watch this effing video. Okay? What are you going to cover? Oh, no. I was fake engaged to somebody. Oh, no. I was an idiot. Yeah, I said I was an idiot. Oh, no. I cover foodie beauty. Oh, no. <laughs> I have been nothing but nice to you. Your butt hurt because I'm watching a panel and I'm seeing for my face how you treat people. You're pushy, you're entitled, you don't take no for an answer, and I'm learning that real fast. Do you want to hear that? You don't take no for an answer. How many times do I have to avoid you in DMs? How many times? I was nice to you because you never did anything to me to make me not nice to you? But now you're annoying. Yeah, no respect for women. You're pushy, entitled, and you do not take no for an answer. Do you want to hear that? No, I don't want to be on your panel. I don't want you to DM me. I don't want you in my chat. Got it? Oh, can we carry on now, you guys? I'm now DC Media Girl is here. What? You're glad this is self-destruction? Oh, sorry, I just, I was so mad right now. 
he's gonna use me. Oh no, I dated garlic bread. Oh no, I was scammed. I was played by a romance scammer, basically. Oh no. <laughs> Good lord. I was an idiot. I know. I'll be the first to say that. <laughs> Jeez. Well, I don't know if DC's coming at me or DC's going for siege. I don't know what's going on, to be honest. Like, I don't even understand <laughs> how this all transpired. I just wanted to watch a video with you guys. <laughs> I just wanted to react to Crazy MFW, and it turned into this. No, he's funny to watch him. He's funny to watch too, Breezy, believe me. It's not the real DC. Oh, okay. Who has you blocked? I don't have you blocked, DC. Um, yeah, there wasn't a happy about whose destruction clarification. Yeah, I'm not sure if she meant towards me or CJ. I know. Oh, no, I fell for some guy's lies. There's a lot of lies out there. Like, no, I did not move my child so I could move out of state. Like, I was talked into renting an Airbnb because we were supposed to buy a house out here. He wanted me to buy a house with his mother. And my Airbnb was very nice. It was very expensive. And we lived it up for a few months in there. And it was wonderful. <laughs> um, what is even going on? This got crazy tonight, you guys. No, I don't want to be on your panel, no. I don't want none of your time, no. I don't want no scrub. CJ, leave me alone and get the hell out of my chat. Anyways. <laughs> Did everything calm down? Can we continue to watch this? <laughs> like, crap seems to hit the fan, you guys. Like, every time I watch MFW... With you guys, it seems like something happens. Like, it's either me MFW going crazy. This time it was CJ. Like, <laughs> no, I didn't move to Kuwait. I moved by the beach in Long Beach temporarily. I'm not there anymore, but it was beautiful. I lived less than a mile from the ocean. It was amazing. It was a beautiful little beach house. Like, I feel like me and my daughter, like, we got so much closer through all this. Like, it's weird how everything happens. Like, it sucks, and I wish I never told her I was in a relationship. No, she never FaceTimed with him or talked with him on the phone. Um, it was always talking through me. Like, he would tell me, say hi to Breezy Jr. She would say, say hi back. It was like that. But um, I don't know. There's so many lies out there. But this person fully had me believe that we were buying a house together. We talked about buying an RV and traveling the world and filming it and not traveling the world, but traveling the, the States um, and filming it. Like, you know, I was buying stuff every single month because I thought I was going to either fly out to see him, but like I was too scared to fly. So he was going to come out here. So he'd have me buy stuff like in pre preparation for him coming out and he would never come. Like it was just, it was a lot of wasted money and a lot of lies. Um, but I learned a lesson, like cover it all you want. I was an idiot. Bane said, oh, thank you so much for the super chat. I didn't mean to step on your comment. You said it awesome. He has a long lore of abuse and talking down to women. True. Thank you so much for the super chat, Bane. I got a super chat. I got a super chat. Bane sent me a super chat. Woohoo. Um, Neg said, why don't you go to bed, get some beauty sleep? You need it. I do. You're right. But I'm going to be up for a little while. Thanks for, I'm like a fart in the wind. Kind of. Um, this is future faking. It was wild. It was just a lot of wasted money on things. Like, I don't know. I know he tried to make it sound like he bought all my groceries and did this and did that. Like, I can't even tell you how much money I spent. It's embarrassing. The whole situation is embarrassing. But, like, I've moved on. Um, I learned lessons from it. Like, you know, <laughs> I learned a lot of lessons from it. What happened, Minka? Real or fake? Fake next. I was terminated, you idiot. All right. Well, this got fun. 
sorry. Like I said, it seems like late night here, like I get more honest than like I've ever been on here. <laughs> like I'm me, but like during the day I'm more like mom breezy and at night I'm like me breezy, if that makes sense. A ray of sunshine. All right, let's watch some more of this. I have heard CJ um, <laughs> comes back on. I will never, and I mean God, God damn it, I will never talk to you in private or beyond. I am you tell me. I came, came up here, here okay, because, because thank you, bees against BS. I know you don't need it because you, you have, have people, people who believe you and support you with it. But the way CJ treated you is something he's been doing to a lot of people, and I wanted you to know you're not fucking. You're not crazy. You're not alone in it. You, there, it's happened to other people. Maybe different circumstances, but the common denominators are the same. I'm so okay. So I'm not crazy, and you know, I'm blown away. But he lies. Hold on, you guys. This CJ's or C, oh, yeah. CJ's DMing me. This is sad. Stay away from me. And then I got blocked. Wow. Fun times. All because I'm watching a panel. <laughs> wow. I don't want to be anywhere around you since I know you're watching. Like, I feel really bad for you. Dean, Dean. Like, like. I'm, I'm blown, blown away. away. Where, Where do I play 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 right, right now? now? You know what I mean? So what's going to have to happen, you're not going to know everything right now. You're just going to have to wait and see the proof that's sent to you from various people and make up your own decision if you even want to give it that time of day, because there's a lot to go through. But there's there's a big, um, oh, here we go. CJ, Look, do not she like she me. She already, she Tell already me said I had nothing to do with on. it. I don't know. I like she, the thing she's referencing. I had nothing to do it, but I sent you the video proving she. Oops! What happened? So, so if he's he's need clarification, clarification or something, or something like, like I said, said, he was the one who sent them out. It's very clear. J Love is the one that did that. He is a content creator. He has a responsibility with what he allows in his community, and if he allows his moderator to go around blackmailing um, people within his community's photos that are very personal and not, uh, you know, get rid of that behavior. He is responsible for that. No, like, I can't believe it. I, I, I don't know. I'm sorry. I'm try He's trying to be up here. I kicked him off. I didn't mean to. Sorry. I'm coming. He's going to lie to me. Men are always good at lying to me. Well, he's we going Sorry, I was talking. Um, just download this video, and I hope you took screenshots if you needed to for how this all started because I don't want to just be another person that gets attacked by him and everybody doesn't know the full story. Like, we were reacting, and he came in here starting problems. So I don't know. I just don't trust him, especially now after these DMs. Um, he just wouldn't take no for an answer. So let that be known. Um, I just have a really bad feeling about all of this right now. So like as I download this video, like just, I don't know. He doesn't seem very well right now. Yeah. What are you talking about? Lying about what? Tell me the truth, CJ. What the fuck is going on? The things that she referenced, like think about this. If she, if If I owed her money, why did she pay me back money that she borrowed from me? Does that make any sense to you? You're trying to misconstrue the timeline, CJ, and that you said it was at the end. You literally just said that. But it doesn't mean that it wasn't after. You Is this you, Tater Tots? I accidentally called you Titty Tots. I'm very sorry for that. Is so? Is this you? Are we watching you? Welcome, you guys. Is this Tater Totties? Gloating. I don't know what he's doing, but he doesn't seem okay. I'm just gonna say that. Um. Yeah, Inferno. Oh, hi. 
would you like to one day come up and explain all of this? Like one day do a panel. I'm usually on like late, late at night, but I'd love to know more and like what exactly is going on and what happened. I don't know how much you saw, but he just came for me in here and now he's DMing me, throwing a temper tantrum. Um, he's very upset that we're reacting to this. Okay, I think I can go live again either Sunday or Monday. Um, Saturday night, I don't think tomorrow night I can at all. Um, I'm spending time with my daughter and her dad. So I don't think I can do it tomorrow night. Um, but I would love to Sunday and, or Monday if you're free. I'm on Twitter and IG if you'll DM me. It's the same name as here. Um, but I would absolutely love to have you on. I'm trying to learn all about this. I was trying to CJ and somebody else kept distracting us, throwing temper tantrums. So, titty tot. Yeah, you you called him a titty, a big old titty, and so we thought that was hilarious. And when I was trying to say your name, you came. I ended up calling you titty tot or tooty titty. I can't. It was something like that. Okay, I'll follow you back. Um, just let me know which day is best for you, and um, we'll make it. We'll make it happen. I'm guessing CJ left after I timed him out. I guess so his whole stay away from me, like, dude, I've been avoiding you. <laughs> like, I don't know. Titter Tots, it's like the best name ever. Can you make merch that says that please, Tater? <laughs> Sunday works perfect. Okay, let me work it out. I'll double check and see what's going on. But um, Sunday night, probably like around midnight, that's good for me if it's good for you. So you guys, um. If you're here tonight, come back someday. All right, we're going to keep watching. Feel free to inform us of things in the chat. I'm going to try and let this play as much as I can because I want to watch the rest of this tonight before I go to sleep. <laughs> so I'm going to try and get through this. I'll mute myself and um, feel free to clear up anything. And if it's okay, I know a lot of us have questions, so we might ask you a few questions because this is a lot. And I don't like how we talk to you one bit. I don't like how he talked down to you. I don't like, I just, I've realized he doesn't take no for an answer. And I see that. And um, I'm sorry for anything you've been through. Like, this is a lot. I can't imagine going through it. Don't so, even twist it up. You fool. And why do you keep referencing me it's with the pictures? Why, what do you, so, so if, so if Jaleb had something to do with the pictures, what do you want me to do with it? What should I do? I had nothing to do with it. So why do you even bring it up? Why do I care? Dude, that is your moderator that you back up. So what do you want me to do? Throw them out of the community? What do you want? You don't have to sit there and message me and say, forget about it. She didn't do it. She didn't lie when the proof is out there. I don't well, know. She told me she didn't. To do with what with, with your moderators, what you choose to do, CG, that's on you. But to sit there and try to gaslight me with a fucking experience that is horrible. Come on, well, dude. She said it didn't like, happen. Well, oh, it's fucking out there, dude. It, the proof is out there. The proof is in the pudding. The pudding's all over my fucking page. You don't have, it doesn't have to be played. Go watch it, dude. Why don't you invest some, just no, I'd rather not. an hour into the fucking time? Because I've invested hours and hours of my life into your situation to help you out and to protect you as a person. Yeah, I'd rather not. The truth? Hey, Jay. <clears throat> wow. He does not like that I'm telling the truth. That's fine. I'm not here to please him. I'm here to defend my friend. myself and anybody else that that goes through something similar wow i don't i don't even know what to say at this point well there's not much to say when you look as good as you do with the fucking red wig on sorry, sorry I, I keep please I, keep bye. Bye. Hold on, hold on. I don't i don't know you to say it's, it's a drop out it's a control tactic that he does. He'll he'll jump in, jump out. What do you think about my red wig? Tactic? What the fuck? To control the topic, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. Watch this. Oh shit. Oh shit. 
Now, Listen. now, what the fuck did you have to say about Miss Fucking Wonderful? Oh wait, I, I what did you just say about the wig and all that? Oh, th there's nothing to say when you look as good as you do with the fucking red wig on. Damn. All right. Wow. But now they say, I need to know, brass tacks, what the fuck is going on? You're talking I don't know. shit. I don't, I don't even know. I don't even know what she's CJ? trying to talk about. I don't know what she wants from me. I don't know why she keeps saying like something about. So if J-Love did that stuff, what do you want me to do about it, by the way? What do you I don't want know, but I don't know what you should do, CJ. That's your Why decision. are you, so you're up here, you're like, oh, CJ uh, won't throw J-Love out of a community because I, making process. because I said I she did this. The final decision is, oh, and by I, the way, Katie, I sent you the video. Do. Okay, hold on. Hear me and shut, shut me up isn't going to work, CJ. Okay, you want to come up? Let me share the, hold on. I would love if you want to come up now. I don't know why I didn't just invite you up, to be honest, but. I'm not really thinking that straight right now. I'm getting a little sleepy. All right, here is. All right, I think Tay is coming up. I'm just gonna call you Tay since I can't apparently say your name. <laughs> there should be music. Okay, hold on. Let me stop sharing the screen for just a moment. We can always come back to that. Do, 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 I think that's how it goes. All right, Tay's here. Hello. Hi. Hey. Well, it's so nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. Wow, this was wild. How do you feel? I I feel good for not doing what a lot of us have done as X mods. Yeah. And that's be silent. Yeah. Um, and I did say a comment in the chat I kind of wanted to go over. Look, this is history that, that's run deep, but mm -hmm. it's also very recent, as recent as a few days ago. So this history goes a while and it goes back and not everybody has played nice. And I can say that, but he and some of his moderators being the one I reference, mm -hmm. J love do not, they're, they're the worst. Really? And he, oh yes. Oh yes. Um, and I left during the summer. They were about MFW and him were about, I think four streams, four episodes in mm -hmm. and there was some other drama that's been going on in other communities that he meddles in. And I can share some of that information with you if okay. you need it. Yeah. Um, and I just had had enough because it was heavily involving children. Not, and not in the way you guys think where, where our minds go to with okay. that, but yeah. in more of just like a people attacking other people's kids type of thing. Mm -hmm. That's so powerful. Exactly. And he wasn't addressing it with a specific creator. So I was like, I can't, I can't stand by this anymore. I'm going to, I'm going to go touch some grass. The mm. moment that happened, because I know what I know about him and I know a lot of people and I'm friends with everyone. He's pretty much hurt in the past, except for a few here and there, he started attacking me. So this brings us through to the new year. Mm -hmm. Just last week, uh, an unfortunate, horrific thing happened to me. Uh, he didn't have anything to do with the official situation pertaining to J Love with my stillborn daughter's photos. Yeah. But those photos were shared with incompetence as two friends mm -hmm. in an emotional moment. And she blackmailed me with them. He's chosen not to look at the blatant proof on my channel of yeah. her voice and now he's lying about it so that for me is just like okay you're the you're the kind of guy that i've backed up in a lot of situations regretfully so mm -hmm. and you're gonna lie on me with this instead of just doing what an appropriate creator would do and that's handle it behind the scenes and with responsibility towards your moderator right so 
I'm so sorry. Like I, my heart breaks for you. And I was, I didn't even want to talk about it at first when um, I was trying to explain what you had said that he'd done. Like that's it's, I'm so sorry you went through that. And like, I wish I could hug you right now. Like my heart hurts for you. And to have somebody like exploit that and even do that is that's evil. Evil is what it is. And thank you for that like moment of empathy. And I would accept the hug, honestly. <laughs> um, <laughs> I'm a hugger. Um, <laughs> yeah. But, you know, going up on MFW, the whole reason I wanted to go up there was just to help her, like, not feel gaslit because that's what he was doing. And although she has controversial behavior, I agree upon that. Yeah. Um, she doesn't deserve to be gaslit. No. If I can help it. Yeah. No, that's good that you were trying to help her, especially, I don't think. Sometimes she's in the right frame of mind. So like maybe she needs somebody to help her in that aspect and be like, hey, this is going on. You can't see it. But um, I know when I was drinking a lot, my mind was foggy. I couldn't see a lot of things that were happening. So I feel for her in that. At, at first when I was watching their fights happen, um, I don't know. Like I automatically just don't want to believe MFW because like, I don't know. That's I'll be honest about that. I just automatically didn't want to believe her. And but the more she talks and the more I'm learning about him and the more I've experienced with him, I'm, I'm thinking he's the problem with everybody. <laughs> like if everybody's saying he's doing this, he's the problem. He's probably the problem. Clary, thank you so much for the super sticker. I got a super sticker. I got a super sticker. Carrie sent me a super sticker. Woohoo. Thank you. And thank you for joining. I'm so sorry. So much is going on. I saw you joined and I wanted to sing the little song, but I owe you the song. Okay. Um, is it okay, Tay, if like if people have questions, if they can ask you? Absolutely. Like, would, you, would you be open Absolutely. to that? Yeah, yes. I'm still learning. I'm still learning. There's so much history with everything. So um Oh yeah, it is deep history, girl. And it just I don't even know. There's so many different parts to it. So I'll do my best to stick with just my experience until yeah. I can, you know, yeah. Come with people, I guess. Yeah. I still, I need to watch the full documentary on everything that happened before. I'm not going to ask you anything about that because I know you can't say anything like you weren't there, you know? Um, Actually, can I oh. clarify something on that? Yes. Because it's a very important thing. Okay. CJ is spreading around this audio mm -hmm. that he says that he accuses me, blatantly accuses me of saying, oh, she was trying to set me up. Okay, mm -hmm. first off. That's all wrong, and here's how this goes. So in 2000, believe, 19, mm -hmm. his uh, Amber C, his uh, rape victim, I don't know. Do you want me to code the words here? Um, no, it's okay. I th I'm pretty sure at this point where we're going to be demonetized, so go ahead. <laughs> Just speak freely. <laughs> speak freely. <laughs> okay. So sorry. Um, so his rape victim kind of contacted me. We were in contact a little bit. Yeah. Um, and she said to me, she said, Hey Taylor, uh, I have a heart. My other channel is heartbeats vanity. She said, Hey Taylor, I'd like to use your channel heartbeats vanity to kind of get out my story about CG. I'm finally ready to speak about it. Mm -hmm. And I thought about it with her and I, I tried to answer this the best way that I could with her because I just, I didn't want to lead her on to something. Right. Yeah. So I said, Hey, my channel is probably not the right space for you. I don't, I'm not getting very many views. It's not the right platform. It's not the right genre. I think you'll have better luck getting this out in the proper way mm -hmm. if you take it to a bigger creator. And I said, do you know anybody that might be able to help you with that? She said, okay, uh, I'll, I'll, I'll check around. I don't know how much time, because this was years ago, right. that it took her to get another creator around. But she came to me and she said, hey, do you want to talk with me and Rag Reynolds yeah. about the situation over on Instagram? I said, sure. So on and so forth. We talk. It's like a three-way message area on Instagram. Mm -hmm. I don't really have a whole lot to add to everything. So what I suggested was I said, hey, let me try to get in good with CJ so I can get his side of the story, his alibi. And we'll match it up with the old alibi. And we'll see if there's any inconsistencies because they were going to do their documentary. Right. So I do have a small part to play in that documentary, but that's where he misconstrues this conversation. Oh. What he doesn't tell people 
is I'm very close friends with the individual who recorded that conversation. Mm -hmm. So I have the full audio. He oh, has wow. the edited, switched up, spliced up audio. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Um, JD, thank you so much for the super sticker. I got a super sticker. I got a super sticker. JD sent me a super sticker. Woohoo. I just call it a super sticker. Sorry. <laughs> I'm getting sleepy. Um, it looks like Bane wants to come up. Um, I don't know if they're gonna ask questions or they have hi. Hello there. Hello. I can back up everything Taylor's been saying because I've been watching lurk watching since 2017. She and I have been on and off talking on Discord for uh -huh. five years, is it? Yeah, years. I think something like that. Oh, wow. Because yeah, I went through the whole, because I found him by accident by, watch, by looking at a certain website during the big Amber drama. And I watched that live and then I couldn't help. Oh, Stop watching him, and it just so it'd be up late. Just watch replays of the screen, and every person that CJ has been with, he's turned on. Yeah. Oh, really? And Taylor, Negs, Dina. The list so, goes on. So this is on. just what he does. This is just MFW, what he does. MFW, every yeah. single person. And then the other night, he did a stream, and he brought up his list of his past. He went all the way back to Mask Babe. He brought up someone who hasn't been online in years and years and years. He brought up, and he never lets anything go. He just can't do it. Wow. And it's really tough for him. And he, he just, it all takes it to heart. But then it's like he takes on this need or want for vengeance and and it's he it's not and it's just like taylor said it's not just him because i've watched j-lo i watched marie mm -hmm. because they were his little minions because one time i got onto his discord and he was yeah. recording me yeah. and i said well, are you recording me well yeah she's probably not gonna know about a lot of this so i'm sure like we'll probably get into that mm -hmm. because doesn't know who Marie is, so we're gonna have to like explain. No, yeah. no, yeah. I'm just talking about his little backup. He used to have a squad of researchers that have pulled away, is like mm. that. And uh -huh. I'm just saying that he's not he's not the smart enough person to where he was recording me, and I was like, um, you don't have permission to record me. And he and he goes, Well, wait a minute, what state are you from? And I said, Where I was from, and he looked it up and goes, It was one party state. My my state is a one party state with a special exemption. You need the person's permission to ever yeah. broadcast what they record ever no. online. That's what my state requires. So it's a one party system with an exemption where you need my permission to ever use anything you recorded to me. Mm -hmm. And he didn't inform me that he was recording me. So he, so. Yeah. And I figured so, I just kind of know about that whole topic right there. And then, um, if there's any questions, like I said, I'm down to answer anything. Yeah. Chad, do you guys have any questions? Um, Soul Blossom, you did warn me about CJ. And you see, what the thing is, like, when I started my channel and started doing YouTube, like, everything just kind of happened. Like, I didn't know I would have a channel. I didn't know I would have to know who everybody on YouTube is, basically, and their whole story. I didn't know all of this. So, like, I haven't been watching everybody for 800 years and... Um, MFW, I feel like I've been watching when she was talking about the Slayton sisters and I would watch on and off. Um, and then she, I heard her say the N word enough times and I stopped watching her after that. But, um, like I'm still learning about the history of Negs and everybody. And as far as CJ goes, when everybody was warning me, it was more like, I didn't know what happened with everything. <laughs> I had no idea. I knew everybody was telling me he was bad and I knew, I'm okay. I'm listening to that, but I need to know what happened. So I'm still learning everything. Um, I've seen with my own eyes now, um, how crazy <laughs> I'm going to yeah. say it. This behavior is, I'm um, coming into the chat, starting trouble just because we're reacting to something <laughs> he did. He went online screaming at you guys. So we're reacting to it when I'm pointing things out to him. He didn't like that through a temper tantrum. Um, and then now he's all of a sudden DMing me and all upset. And you know what the truth of it is? Like, I don't want to expose what he said, but I will say this. 
he even said sorry like he was persistent about me coming on i've been busy i can't i had to say to him many times i will say this i said to him many times just because you want me on your panel doesn't mean i can drop everything i'm doing and go on like he was very pushy when i would say no it wasn't he didn't take no for an answer and he got mad because i wouldn't respond and went nuts I'm not going to say exactly the things he said, but that's a nutshell of it. And now he came in tonight acting crazy. I'm saying, no, leave. We don't want this here. Go away if you can't behave. And he wouldn't leave. So now he wants to expose me, cover me, whatever he said he's going to do. It's just he he doesn't like the word no, especially from a female, it seems oh. like. I'm sorry. I'm just saying it. And you that's exactly what I can corroborate. And yeah. sorry. It is. I can say that yeah. whenever he's told no with something, he definitely gets upset with you. And here's what I can say. Um, mm -hmm. My experience. Okay. He was going through his lawsuit with this girl named Harvard Chicky. He um, wiretapped Harvard Chicky and uh, basically stole money from her and she sued him. Mm -hmm. um, and he had to pay the money back or whatever, but he had to travel a far way to get to the court dates. Now he had us all believing that he was the major victim or especially me, that he was like a major victim in it all. And I fell right for it because he's convincing when he gets in your head, that type of thing. Yeah. And so he asked me, yo, can I borrow $100? And I'm like, oh, sure. No problem. I had a little extra cash. It was fine. No big deal. I'm usually the type of person that if, if I have a friend and I considered him a friend at the time, if I have a friend in need, I'll, I'll give it to them. Yeah. Then about a week later, he asked me for another hundred. So I gave him another hundred. He said, I'll pay you back. It's fine. I didn't badger him. Three mm -hmm. days later, it's me for another hundred. I could only do $50 yeah. and pissed him off. You could tell it pissed him off. Yeah. And then I didn't badger him to pay me back. Like he, he said that, oh, oh, I'm the one who needs to pay him back. No, I never badgered him to pay me back. In mm -hmm. fact, I moderated heavily for him one day and, um, he said that he was going to start like paying his moderators or something like that, a little fee that he throws his moderators some, some side cash. And I'm the one who built his entire discord and set up a lot of his tech stuff. So, um, you know, I figured, Hey, where's my fucking cash? You know, like 35 bucks. You said it. I wanted to see if he was going to follow through or if he was on drugs again. Mm -hmm. And, uh, he did. Yeah. He yeah. paid me, expected me to pay him back. And so these are the type of behaviors that you see. I mean, not only that, you have the boob gate situation. In mm -hmm. two, um, 2018, he took photos of his moderators uh, in the NSFW, the not safe for work, and then one of them was personal, nude photos, and plastered them all over his stream. Like wow. he, As a form of vengeance again. Yeah. Because they were acting out as mods or whatever he wanted to claim against them, which wasn't true. But Actually, he did it as vengeance. Actually, he was getting downvoted. He was telling people, if this thing keeps getting downvoted, I'm going to do this because he thought people were attacking him. And another time, too, he, he had a couple. That was one time, another time, too, where he's getting downvoted and he thought people were downvoting him on purpose. Mm -hmm. And there was the other time. But, but every time, it's just to get back. And there's extensive. You can look up his name within two to three down on the list, you'll see prominent people who are growing in the YouTube drama community, people who mm -hmm. are just in the biggest thing that just happened. Um, his name is, I'm just going to say Augie RFC. He has had him on and okay. he's had him. And she's not the best creator now anymore, but her name was Creep Show Arch. And she had a falling out, blah, blah, blah. She had her own drama, but she made a video. Yeah, I think, but you're kind CJ, of that he CJ has exposed. Yes. Yeah. But yeah. The video got three almost three hundred thousand views. Wow. Um, Tate, you have some questions. So someone asked, did he ever pay you back? No, he never did. Oh wow. I even emailed him and said, Yo, let's just I'll make it easy on you because I know you have money issues. Mm -hmm. But you know, you know you did F me over in this. Can you pay me back at least just one fifty? One hundred. Just show yeah. that you and he basically said, everybody thinks you're a liar. So, you know, no one's going to believe you. Literally. Mm -hmm. In black oh and white. Gosh. He isn't well. I'm sorry. Okay. And Dr. Drea said, what was the first incident where you realized CJ wasn't a good person? That's a complicated question to answer because 
it kind of I've gone back and forth and here's why. So the first incident was when he did the revenge porn stream mm-hmm. because of how he handled it, what he did and how he handled it years later and how he still handles it and treats the people that he did it to to this day. Okay. He treats Tush, the main victim, like crap, talks shit about her all the time. Yeah. There was that moment, but you know, w- even Tush, we've gone back in the community and tried to work it out and believe him and, and believe him that he said he was going to change. So we would go back and think he would change. So this time, the final time was with this incident with his moderator. His moderator, J-Love, could have done, that's the worst thing she could have ever done to me. That's the worst thing she could have done to literally anybody on the internet, I yeah. think. Yeah. And what he told me in text message is, let it go. She, you're lying. Oh no one's going to believe you. I don't believe she did that. I said, there's the, the proof is in the pudding. It's on my page. Go mm-hmm. check. It. He says, I refuse stuff like that. So he watched me after all I've done for him as a friend, backed him up, took shit for him, stuck up for him when I knew deep down guys. And I'm going to be real. I knew it was wrong to stick up for him, but I did because I, I don't know. He got, he had me wrapped up in this feel sorry for me thing. And you wanted to be loyal, I'm sure, and like have that sense of that. Wow. Yeah, but you got to give yourself some grace. Yeah. Too, as you've been going through a lot yourself. You've got, you know, what's going on with your own life. You know, we have our realized we have this online life, which is just kind of something most of us just, we want to come here to relax and get away. And then we get sucked into this. And some people just, sadly, they suck us in with the puppy dog eyes or the peel back mm-hmm. because we're, empathetic people we all all three of us i consider very empathetic people and it's hard Mm. not to want to drop that and go i want to help this person i want to save this person and no matter how many times you throw out the lifeline and you're like well okay one more time and it's no different than any other toxic abusive relationship and there's only so many times you can give yourself you know, just like you tried and you tried and you tried and, you know, he hurt you really bad. And it's, it's just one of those experiences where you learn from it, but you did try. And I can testify to it. She tried, she would, she stuck up for him when no one else would. And she was loyal to him and he, but he, Taylor was the worst one that I think he burned because she stuck through him with him through hell, fire, and burn. Sounds like it. It sounds like so. it. And see, like, this is not coming from a place of vengeance for me because that would be easy and that would have happened months and months ago. Mm-hmm. I, I left it alone. I, you know, I could have gone around when he was having drama months ago, but I didn't. And so... The reason it's I'm speaking up now is because he just will not stop. He won't stop sending people my way to to do what they're doing. He doesn't stop his moderators from attacking me in such a way that is like life changing. And he lies about everything. Yeah. Can I ask you a question? Um, Because he kept basically during his temper tantrum yelling about this he said that you follow him from every community can i ask about that so i think what he might be referencing in there is that we're i'm 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 a part of a community that's kind of an off branch of what was known as like the bottom of youtube where we kind of go and hang out we don't really care about playing music on our streams and we just you know shoot the shit with each other so i think that what he's meaning because we're heavily involved in these little off branch communities. So where I go and I hang out, he, he has talked about these people or streamed with these people before, or he'll go on their panel and hang out. But I am hardly ever on a panel when he's on a panel. In fact, I try to avoid him to avoid a big blowout. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Okay. I wanted to say that because he kept screaming that she follows me everywhere. She follows me everywhere. So like, just so everybody knows, since we all had to see it, like, I just wanted you to address it and be, be able to clear that up if that makes sense. Yeah. Um, and- uh, Kate is Bain. Everybody loved your response and what you said to um, 
Tay, I wanted to let you know, like everybody in the comments really loved oh, your I response. Couldn't even, I couldn't even see the chat. I'm on my phone. And, oh. but, it's, but it's the <laughs> truth. It's, she, has, <laughs> she has walked through Hellfire and Brimstone for the man, and she's given him multiple chances. And the other thing, back to her point, too, is yes, it was. there's there's the top tier that there's, you know, they're just, we now, okay, all three of us have grown up in an age now where we started with cable i started with okay i'm old enough to know i started with three channels okay i'm that old <laughs> uh -huh. and then we got to cable then we got more and now we have unlimited tv because anyone can broadcast themselves yeah so everyone creates a little niche and a little thing so there's all kinds of people who want to hang out and then it always creates almost like these little soap operas within these communities and well and i want to get Clear. I, I want to make it very clear, guys. I've had some times where I have popped off. Like, mm -hmm. there have been times I've been extraordinarily frustrated. And um, I bet when, when you're dealing with the intricate levels of which you're seeing someone get away with so much behavior, and you know, you know things, but you're challenged within yourself. You're like, why am I not defending myself? Knowing that I know the truth and knowing that I have things to back up what I'm saying while he's running amok on his platform of 17,000 people to smear me a little yeah. nobody. And That's wrong. Again, it seems like he abuses his platform. He, he does. He if, you it, were, yeah. if, if I said it earlier and I'll say it again, as someone who is he does and just I, I watch different things because I'll just say that you know YouTube has a need for its algorithm doesn't work perfectly it's still a computer program in its process so it needs human vision it needs people to look over it so there are people who look over things and just let them know hey you know you're not your algorithm's not catching this not catching this i'm not talking about freedom of speech i'm talking about purely abusive content that just slips through the cracks uh -huh. that is allowed because there's so there are million i mean there are probably in the there are probably millions of channels because we don't count we only think of america and other things but if you you'll get recommended there's India, there's China, there's all kinds of other numbers on this platform. And so things slip through the cracks. And so it still needs some moderation. But in that, there's these communities, which is where, which called the void. And then they also kind of fracture off. And there's people who want to hang out, talk and hang out with some people. And then- What is it called? Reason, the void? The Boit, just like bottom of YouTube. Oh, okay. You know, so that's the, okay. Like that's the nickname. Okay. Uh, yeah. I'm learning. And, and it, I'm learning things yeah, here. Okay. Sorry. Yeah. And it has subgroups, you know, just like any other thing. But basically, it's people, friends hanging out. Yeah. And it gets recorded. And then you'll either get some people who start to argue with each other. You'll get some people who are sadly want to troll people, make fun of people. So they come in there, like, going to call it like I see it too. Tragic gets in there. He is an open troll. He does not care. He, He's he so two-faced. I'm sorry. Yeah. That guy is so two-faced. Yeah, and that's what he does, but he wants the reaction. That's his endorphin rush because he doesn't, because there's this thing where people are, we have our real lives where we have to work, we have to take care of our families, but then there's people who don't. They're chronically online, and then they get sucked into this where there's these younger people now who, that's all that they have. Like, there were big drama with team star and all them and that was because these people are chronically online they chronicle each other they take screenshots of each other yeah they create this they create that where it's almost become is this the newest form of of entertainment where you don't know if it's real or fake? and the top level i'm talking about the top level because it's so overblown and you're just like the lower take... right now though yeah. <laughs> do you guys just take screenshots of every single conversation you have because it's that deep and it's just like i don't have time for that and i just mm -hmm. don't have the energy or and then that's what it gets into but then you get the regular people who just want to hang out and have fun but then there's still always going to be some troublemakers and then it creates that snowball effect 
But then there's people who honestly want to be friends, help each other out. And then, you know, you get sucked into that. And Kayla is a great example where she did everything she could. And I am proud of her because she finally stood up and yeah. she went through hell. And I'm, I think that she, Kayla, you've deserved every moment to pop off. You've deserved a hundred times more that you didn't pop off. Yes, just a compliment. <laughs> well, I mean, true. I'm, I'm not very good at taking compliments, I'll be honest. But, and you know, <laughs> maybe that's just, maybe that's just part of me. I don't know. But I mean, like, I have to be real. I am interested in what, how he's treated you. I, I, I need to know Breezy because like, not because of like a personal, but I just, it seems like he really fucking went in on you. And that makes me feel scared because I know what might be coming next. And he, if he came in here tonight and mm -hmm. I, I chat and he said to you, he's going to be streaming about you. Yeah. Like he will be. It was just really like uncomfortable. You know, I'll talk about it. Cause if he's going to expose me, then go ahead. Here's the conversations. Like, Okay, so I started, oh, hold on, we have a different Sage. Thank you so much. I appreciate you and think you're a wonderful person and mother. Thank you for all you do. Bless you. Thank you and may God bless you. I got a super chat. I got a super chat. Sage sent me a super chat. Woohoo! Thank you so much. Um, I'll probably end up, I'll check my DM too. Um, Tater Toddies and <laughs> I said it right, Tay, and I'll send you screenshots because um, basically, Okay, so I started checking in to watch their podcast, right? Because it was like, it was, you wanted to know what was going to happen. You never know what MFW is going to say. It's wild. She's entertaining. Despite like, however you may feel about her, she's entertaining. Like we all agree on that, right? Um, so I started checking in on the podcast and like, just like leaving comments like, hey, if they would talk about me or like, especially when the garlic bread situation happened, just like saying I was in the chat. And then um, he started asking me to come up on panel and I'd always be like, hey, 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 maybe, you know, um, and when I would say that everybody started warning me, mm -hmm. um, but he started becoming more and more persistent and in my DMs, um, always asking me to come up and would get like kind of upset when I couldn't come up. And I, that's when I would have to tell him like, hey, I'm a mom. I'm also an aunt. Like, I can't just drop everything I'm doing because you want me to come up on your panel. And then it would start with, if I wasn't responding, what, you think I relapse? Everybody thinks I relapse. And I'd be like, whoa, chill out. Like, no, I'm not saying that. Um, that's not what I thought at all. But I did tell him, and he can show this in a screenshot too. I did tell him, if you keep bringing up, why do you think I relapse? You think I relapse? I said, if you keep doing that, people are going to think you relapsed. <laughs> and I said to him too, one time, I was like, do you know how many people accuse me of drinking on the internet? Like how many people are like, Oh, just boozing or says like, make fun of me because of my addiction or whatever. Like, but I don't always address it because I know I'm sober. So why does it matter? You know? Um, and then one time he had asked me three times in a row to come on. I didn't respond. And then he wrote, okay, then, and then some other sarcastic remarks and then I finally let him have it. And if this, I'll show you the screenshots. And then I finally let him have it. And I'm like, look, I'm sick of your BS. Like, I'm a mom. I help take care of my nephews sometimes. Like, I babysit and stuff. Like, I have a life. I'm busy. Like, you're getting really annoying by asking me to come on all the time and then getting upset when um, I can't come on. And, like, I told him off. And then he asked me again. He's like, well, everybody just thinks I relapsed. Did you think I relapsed? Um. And that's basically, it was just really weird, like always like upset, defensive, pushy, not taking the hint that like, I can't do it. I don't want to come on the panel, like kind of leave me alone. <laughs> he would just, I don't know how to explain it. Um, and then he came in here um, all upset, throwing his little tantrum when I was pointing out things, making good points, making like things he could answer, answer it, clear it up. If it's not true, he would, I don't know. He just got all upset here and now he's going to start covering me. And he said he saw my true colors. Like, what are my true colors? Like, you got upset because I was reacting to a panel you were on? I don't know. And it seems like I noticed during your panel, Tay, with MFW, he was upset that she let you on or that you she had you on her channel. And he's upset that I'm reacting to him. Like, why is he trying to control what we all do, watch, or who we have on our channels? Like, who is he to control that? Because he doesn't want the truth getting out. And he knows that 
you know, even though we've all had fights within the community that's being referenced, mm -hmm. his, the truths are in abundance and his, his bad behavior does not end. See, if he just did one thing, like back in 2000, whenever he did the boot gate, mm -hmm. if he did one thing messed up and tried his best to, to stop, then that would be different. I think at least for some people who were willing to stay to see if he would change. Yeah. Um, you know, but it didn't change. The money things kept happening. The lawsuits kept happening. The threats, the new girls, uh, you know, the people, the other creators that he was having issues with. Mm -hmm. I mean, the fact that he went up on um, a live stream and he doxed one of his most loyal ever. Her name was Marie. Moderators at the time, he doxed her name and then sent her picture around to the other moderators in the community and it all kind of blew up this summer he lied about it straight to everybody's face when the screenshots were proven that he was the one who sent her picture around knowing she was private um he never addressed it that's what he'll do he'll lie 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 yeah. he'll make up some narrative and he'll never address reality i noticed he never takes accountability i said that to him when he was in the chat and I said, you know, I notice you're always pointing the finger and saying, well, like, she's crazy. She's following me. MFW did this. And I told him, I said, for one thing, I told him flat out, I said, it's weird that, like, you're trying to hook up with all your moderators. So what part are you playing in everything? And um, I don't know. It's just, ugh. he's frustrating. And I feel so bad that you've had to deal with this. I feel so bad for you, Tay. Honestly, you know, Thank you. And I, I completely understand where you're coming from. But I'm also like, I, I just want to say, I feel so bad for how this is probably going to turn out for you. I feel almost like my presence sort of brings around this frenzy because of what I know. Mm -hmm. And it's almost like if I branch out, I, I feel a level of empathy for the, the stress it could put on people around me. You know what I mean? I'll be fine. I'll be fine. Like we're, we're good over here. We have a, our little corner of YouTube is a really like strong knit community. So like, I'll be good. Like and they'll help support me. I'll help support them. If any craziness happens, we'll be fine. And also too, he, he, but you handle what happened to you with humor because we've been through worse hell. Mm -hmm. I've got 18 years clean. You have five years clean. Yeah. No going through that every day. And the highs and the lows that can still sometimes happen even now some days you just feel that little itch or that that temptation and if he wants to bring anything up or bring up any drama he he doesn't have the ability to he may scream about you mm -hmm. but it's not going to be impactful because earlier oh, i'm Carlos is one of his main guys who's always on his channel too. And he was talking, I just want to stick up for my boy. I just want to stick up. But Carlos is always there. And he's also one of those other open trolls. He's always in other people's chats, causing other things. And it's just kind of a revolving cycle because he can't ever, like where MFW was right, he can't produce a podcast. He couldn't find guests. He couldn't find a narrative because all they would end up doing, and you can go back stream after stream after stream of watching their show together, and mm -hmm. it's hours upon hours of content about them ripping on Negs and DC Media Girl. And it was like, yes, we get the point. We get the point. Yeah. We get the point. <laughs> but he never moves on because if he's ever burned him, is his content. Yeah. Well, no, I'm. I completely agree with you because the um, Amber C situation, the rape allegation, even though she did recant her uh, lie, uh, she lied about it and she confessed that uh, there is a big, there's a big uh, clear message that for years she was being bullied before she came up on his panel and recanted it. And there was a oh, huge no. theory Yes. For years he streamed about it. I mean, he would harass her bad, bad, bad. That's and funny. I know because he would share all of it with us. And that's what I mean when I say I feel guilty and ashamed for sticking up for him during that. Because I didn't go badger her, but I didn't say like, oh, you know, CJ, you know, maybe you should stop all this. I said, you know, maybe you got, maybe you should take it on legally. 
mm-hmm. I kept trying to p- push that to him. And then I finally had enough and she had come to me and she said, yo, 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 I want to use, um, I want to get my story out finally. And can we use your platform? And that's when I just had to be honest with her because I was like, this is not the space. I don't have this space that will be safe for you. And I don't want to do you wrong. Yeah. So, um, G Mangos, can you chill out? Tay is over here because um, I had her come up to tell her story. Another troublemaker. So Tay is welcome over here. Um, if you have a problem with it, you don't have to chat here. That's all I'm going to say about that. <laughs> um, but you guys, I would love to continue this on Sunday. If that works for you, um, we could do it around midnight again. Or it's midnight my time. I don't know what time it is for you guys. I will let you two. I will not interrupt. Yeah, absolutely. And that works out really well for me because of the fact that I can give you concisive evidence and proof and things that you would need. And um, I want to address one thing, G Mangoes, that Boyd was not mentioned in any other way other than saying there's off branches that I go into, like in side chats in the bottom of like YouTube. So it wasn't being referenced as a bad thing. That was me, G, who brought up the Boyd. I brought that up as a subculture that was purely on me. So if you want to hate on someone, hate on a random stranger. No, Uh, let's not. We're going to be, we're going to be respectful to you and to Tay and G man goes, I don't know what your problem is. I'm just learning about whatever the heck it is. I'm still learning. Sorry. I'm still learning. So we're not trying to expose it, talk about it much. I just found out and I wasn't really, Home gonna explore much more of it <laughs> in one word except for right now so you're safe Keith. but i think she's let's talk about this sunday and yes. I... yeah i'm gonna get going because mm-hmm. it's a little bit late here but thank you so much and i i look forward to Before speaking you. with you again and thank you to everybody in the side chat thanks all for right having thank me you and i'll dm Thanks. you um tomorrow tay okay okay sounds good all right good night. thank you bane bye you guys bye everybody bye. thanks for hanging out I am going to make a really cool thumbnail, and then I'm going to go to sleep, you guys. <laughs> um, yeah, Jamie, I have no idea. Okay, I'm like, what is the problem? Sheesh. We've already had enough chaos tonight. No more drama. Let's all go to bed. <laughs> all right, you guys. Well, this was wild. I thought we were just going to react to um, other people fighting, and and it turned into this. <laughs> it was interesting. I learned a lot. Um, I hope you guys did too. Freddie. Oh, you got to watch this whole thing, Freddie. This has been a journey. This has been like a thousand years lived in two hours. It's been like that kind of a live stream. Um, Carrie, thank you so much. I owe you the, I owe you the song. I'm so tired right now. Um, Jamie said, learn some. Yeah. If you came in late, I suggest you rewatch everything. It's We've, we've traveled a rough road tonight, but it, it all came out okay. And um, yeah, I'm going to bed. <laughs> good night, everybody. Or good morning. Good night for me. Bye.